Hi, this is Random Guy 818 bringing you another Transformers video review of Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Supreme Class Devastator. As you can see, this guy is just huge, huge figure. And he has lots of, lots of sound effects, gimmicks in him. So let's bring him up a little closer. And the first thing, he has three, um, he has three voice, voice, um, things he says. The first thing he says is, here, let me just play it for you. He opens his mouth and he says, well, he does laugh too when he makes all these noises, but that's not what I'm looking for. Oh, he was supposed to say destroy Autobots at sea again. Oh, he says I am Decepticon, and you couldn't move his mouth like that to make it look like he's talking. So yeah, that's another cool feature. So let's see what else you could say. He also said Devastator Destroy, and... He also said Devastator Destroy. If you leave it for a while, and his mouth does extend, I can actually fit my hand in it, so watch. And when you extend the mouth, he does make the, he does make the, um, drill noises and all those, um, That's pretty much his lights and effects. Really cool, he says lots of things. And he does have lots of effects, motion activated noises as well. He's a really cool figure. He has full, um, let's bring him back. He has full arm. He has like these big old ratchet joints, his arms do move circulate, his legs do, and he has these knees, and he, he, the knees, this part of the knees right here, they act like a stopper, so for long call it's right here, and for rampage it's right here, so it makes him stand up really securely, and you know, he is kind of hard to push down, if you have him on straight, um, like, marble or hardwood floors, or just, just normal floors, but if you have him on carpet, he might, you know, fall down the far part because I did try transforming him on the carpet. So yeah, that's pretty much him. He does have those ear things like in the movie. He's he I seen other reviews about him and lots of people are complaining that he doesn't have enough paint, but he's still a pretty cool figure. I really recommend him. I mean it's still hundred bucks. Hundred bucks is a bit too much but Maybe 80 or 60 or 80 maximum, but still, he's pretty. He's worth it. I'll say he's worth it. Enough about that, and on to the transformation. We'll do the mixer first. I just want to pull it out right from here. He has like these pegs and stuff, so put that for the side. We'll transform him later. And he is. Well, every time I put him down, he does make noises. So, like, whenever he, whenever you push him in, he will make a noise. Look. So, for example, if he, well, he just makes noise whenever you push him in. So I'm just saying that. And also the transformation. What you want to do here is pull out Scrapper and how you, how you transform Scrapper is um. 
push this in like that, rotate this around, pull in the shoulder pieces together. This might be a two part video because I'm running out of time here. Check him out, he does roll freely. Pretty detailed, and he has a nice Decepticon logo right here, and it says BGE. That's all about him. And this shovel does not move because of his figures. And then we're gonna do High Tower next. And for High Tower, all you wanna do is pull out his treads like that, and then pull his fingers in, rotate them out like that, and then push in. There's his pegs. They're gonna just peg into that hole right there. Push the treads in together. And straighten out the tower. And here you have him as robot mode. Let's see the yellow caterpillar crane. And he has a deceptive logo right here and a nice 40777. And um, Scraper was the caterpillar on. So then for the legs, all you want to do is detach Rampage, detach Long Call, and put sca Scavenger right there for now. So for Long Call, all you want to do is pull him out and around like that, then pull this, then you just pick some kind of like that. And then there's a um, tab right there, it just tabs in, just like that. And here's the Caterpillar dump truck, green dump truck. Look about him, and then on to Rampage. All you want to do is for Rampage is just pull this tread like that, pull it in together, rotate it like that, so it'll be straight, and then you just kind of push it in there and it locks in place. The only articulation Scavenger has is um, his, his shovel just goes up and down, and I mean, sorry, I meant to say Rampage. His shovel just goes up and down, and that's pretty much him. And you just have a Decepticon logo and a ANKA111308 right there. He does, he has, he has um, rollers down here. He used uh, to make them roll. That's enough about him. And for the big scavenger, what you want to do is straighten out that. Pull it out. Out of its untab it, round big lock pads. And then for him, take out the shovel. Pull it out. Take this, rotate it down, hide it under the treads. And then push this in together. Have it in place just like that, very nicely, and then pull this, pull this in forward like that, pull this in like that, and here you have a huge excavator, put that for the side too, and last but not least, for mix master, you just want to pull in these ear pieces right here like that, and then you want to pull this. you hear the transformation noise. And then you just want to... He is motion activated, so he makes that noise. And then you just want to clip that in there like that. Just like that. And here they are all together.